Behold, the portable timepiece, also known as the watch. But where did it come from? Meet Peter Henlin, born around Nuremberg sometime in the 1500s. Nowadays, not much is known about Henlin except that he was probably a locksmith. In the 16th century, a locksmith was considered qualified to work on all sorts of mechanical devices, including the clocks of the time, which were notoriously unreliable. Most towns relied on the sun or church bells to keep track of time. As a result, time could vary greatly from one village to the next, that is, until Henlin sprung his invention on the world. Portable timepieces with balance springs. Historians generally agree that while Henlin may not have invented the pocket watch, he almost certainly was the first person to regularly manufacture and sell portable watches. These drum-shaped timepieces run for 40 hours without rewinding and were small enough to be worn on a chain around the neck or carried within a purse. Though the watches only had one hand and appear crude by modern standards, they immeasurably changed Western society and ultimately the world.